There was a door here before, but it was taken out. No insulation, no drywall, nothing. It's just like this, all inside. Olamide Omotosho bought this house in McConaughey nearly two years ago. To his dismay, it's still not ready to live in. This was the siding I mentioned to you, the last, the last thing that was done on the property. Omotosho signed a sales agreement with a Calgary builder he learned about through his church community, obtaining a mortgage and land title. He was given a move-in date, which was later extended. For months, the builder transferred money for the mortgage payments, but then the payments stopped, and so did progress on the house. It's unimaginable, it's unbelievable. If a stress test was conducted, uh, I don't know, we're going to be off that scale. The builder, Three Volution Homes, is owned by Ify Daniels Akunikwe. The company holds a general contractor license in good standing with the province. But court documents show multiple tradespeople in the Edmonton area allege that Three Volution owes them for unpaid work. The company has not filed any statements of defense. The city of Edmonton says permits were cancelled on 13 of the builders' homes because construction wasn't progressing. Look at the kitchen and the, and the living room. We spoke to four homeowners who can't move into their unfinished Three Volution homes. Godfrey Kina has been waiting on this build for more than two years. If not, let me say, grace of God. Maybe by now my wife and me we would have separated because she was so angry for everything and the, the, it's completely destabilized everybody in the family. Both my children, they were angry with, with me. He's responsible for monthly mortgage payments on the house he can't live in. And on top of rent, he says he can't afford it. Complicating matters, Kina has also discovered discrepancies with his Scotiabank mortgage paperwork. On the C4, he says, I earn $116,000 per year. Meanwhile, all my years working in this company where I'm working, I started work there 2014. Till now, I have not crossed 60000 The bank says it's referred the matter to Edmonton police and regulatory bodies. Police say its economic crime section is aware of the complaint and will be investigating. Carmela speaking. This licensed mortgage broker says delays are common on new home builds, but that work is typically done within 18 months. She recommends home buyers research carefully before hiring a builder. Very, very small builders sometimes can sound like their price is better, but if they haven't done enough homes in their career, that could cause problems. Do your due diligence and it's not always the cheapest person that they should be looking for. The city says it's committed to work with Revolution, but it can't compel a company to finish construction. A motor show has also contacted his bank, CIBC, and a spokesperson says the company is investigating. At this point, he and his wife just want out. We're not interested in the home anymore, to be honest for me, because this has uh, robbed our rob me and my family of the joy you would ordinarily have looking forward to going to your new home. It cost me so much pain. Three Volutions owner Ify Daniel Zakunakwe has not made himself available for an interview. He also didn't respond to emailed questions. The company's website is still up and running, advertising new home builds in Edmonton and Calgary. Madeline Cummings, CBC News, Edmonton.